Good evening. What's going on, everybody? Hope everyone has had a great weekend. Felt like I needed to do a stream today. Yesterday, our stream was the uh, Creator's Corner podcast. That was very early in the morning, so feels like I ain't been with you guys in a couple days. Roberts, what's up, Mr. Weedy? Good to see you guys. Had Mania up late in the UK. Anthony, welcome, welcome. Just getting the poll up here. Okay. How's everyone doing today? Alpha, good to see you. So. Our KVK is for all intensive purposes over. Um, we spent a good 45 minutes to an hour with water camp the other day. Um, each of us presented our cases as to why we felt we deserved the zig at the end. Uh, what a, and, and we both do. I mean, really, we both do, right? 2160 did a fantastic job with water camp. Um, you know, they pretty much dominated the fire camp in every aspect. And in the, in the same, in the same breath, you know, us and our allies in the wind camp pretty much dominated the earth camp, right? So at the end of the day, they wanted to zig at the end. We wanted to zig at the end. It literally came down to a coin flip. So once the coin was flipped... Water is getting first occupation and chronicle rewards and wind are my camp is getting the zig at the end. You know, this is our third KVK that we've allied with 2160 in a different camp. Um, they got the zig at the end once we got the zig at the end once. So, you know, it's not even like one of those, okay, you guys had it last time. So we'll take it type deals. It literally came down to a coin flip. Um, so it feels good for us that we got it, but you know, I feel for them because they put in a lot of time and a lot of effort as well in the KVK. Uh, the stats were so close as well. You really couldn't, you know, if the stats were completely lopsided one way or the other, yeah, that's, that's the tail of the tape then. But the stats were real, real close um, for both camps as well. So, you know, hopefully we'll see them in another KVK. Hopefully we can ally with them in another KVK. We were joking with them, you know, so that uh, this shit doesn't come down to a coin flip next time. You know, maybe maybe next time we're in the same KVK, we're, uh, we're enemies instead. So there is no um, shadow of doubt and no coin flip needed, right? Hey, Ghost Rider, what's good? That, uh... Well, okay, it wasn't so much a coin as it was we spun we spun the random wheel. And we did two out of three, right? We did best two out of three, so. Um, we will be getting our second Autric inscription later at the end of this KVK, and yeah, feels good. Feels good. Uh, you know, I didn't want to walk away with, uh, either way, I think I probably would have got one. You know, 11 million deads and 2.3 billion kill points. Um, but, um, you know, we had a lot of people who took a lot of deads on their main account, so it feels good. Only farmer, what's going on? I really, I have not even looked at Osiris League yet. Let's kind of, let's look at my bet history. So, I mean, quite literally, you know, I bet on OG early, early in the week. And then the betting kind of evened out. So I won a little bit there. And then the, the realm of Sobek, I think it is, the very last realm with the newer kingdoms. I just went and I bet on every single underdog. So I think we, I think we won more than we lost. Not bad, not bad. I mean, I'm not a huge gambler, so I don't like gamble at all. What's up, cat? And Alloys, good to see you guys. 
Cat, hopefully you are settling in to your new place there. You have found the grocery stores, the coffee, coffee shops, and uh, things are going well for you in your new location. Um, what were we talking? We were ta oh, Cyrus Lee. I think pretty much these kind of all went as expected here. I don't see any surprises. Then again, there are teams in here I don't even recognize. So if it was a surprise, I can't say. Uh, can't. This was a close match. It's GT and MX in the same group. Well, at least one of them will go to the winner side and one will go to the loser side, right? WIB. There's a 2377. 89 with one team having a convincing, convincing win. 2049. 2049 has two. Oh man. 2 2049. Is this the third? 2049. My goodness. Is this a fourth? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Do you guys really have four teams in the top 32? <laughs> Damn. Six oh five getting a victory. I have no idea who any of these teams are in Sobek. Yeah, it looks like uh looks like a fun day. Hey Mark. Um what happened to BLN though I alloys? Hey, Dracul. Settling in nicely. Good. Good. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I saw they casted one on the official channel this morning, Plato and Drago and Chisgo, right? I went back to watch it and it's gone. Apparently it's set to private now. And the matches that were set to start at 15 UTC and the one that was going to be cast then, the 60 GT match, they never casted it. I, do, I don't get it. I don't get it. Yoda's currently powering up for pre KVK. But he going to hit 2 billion? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe the teams that were going to get cast, that were announced to get cast, maybe they complained to Lilith. You know, because you got to admit, right? It, the community was picking the games that were being cast, okay? No issue with that on the official channel, right? But you're only casting two matches. That seems highly unfair for the teams that are getting getting cast on the live channel. Opponents are going to better be able to prepare for them. They're going to see what strategies that were used. You know, I mean, either either have the ability to cast them all for streamers or do none of them you know otherwise you're providing some teams with an unfair advantage or disadvantage in this case as there's going to be tape of their strategy out there and this season that's i think that's more critical than many seasons you know because you've got you've got some rule changes this you've got the fog of war you've got new skills and i think everyone wants to see how the top tier teams use those and if the top tier teams are being cast early on in the top 32. That's a, that's a huge disadvantage for them. Go! 
Yeah, and that's exactly what we've been saying in our Creators Corner podcast ever since they announced that um, they would only be casting on the official channel. You know, and that's one of the things I said specifically. How are you going to pick the matches? Are you going to cast them all? If you're only going to cast a select few, every single time we brought this up, every single time, I said, that's going to be unfair. Do they not freaking realize that until today when they cast cast one match and then decided to cancel the other ones? I mean, what what world do these people live in? And I understand, you know, they're they're not out here watching our Creators Corner podcast. It gets maybe maybe 500, 600 views. But we're talking about real topics that are a concern for people in the game. We're providing solutions or what we feel would be adequate solutions for the developers to take. And, and yeah, there's cussing and swearing and it might not all be presented in the most quote unquote professional of manners. But in the same respect, if you want to know what your community thinks, you go and connect with your community. You don't just read what's on Discord, listen to what your um, paid content creators are telling you and turn a blind eye to everything else. I mean, seriously, you know, and, and I get it. I get it. I'm an apprentice creator. I don't get paid, you know, but I'm, I'm trying to give them feedback, but uh, do people listen? You know, and I think that's the problem John Wick had way back when, is he was trying to provide them with feedback as well and just felt like nobody was listening. Yeah, they've destroyed it as a spectator sport. Exactly. And I think this season, there's a lot less... What's the word I'm looking for? There, there's a lot less... Uh, there's a lot... Oh, I, I said it on somebody's stream earlier. There's a lot less excitement for Osiris League this season than I, I can remember ever before in the past. And that's because people can't watch it. You know, it's, it's utterly ridiculous. I don't play in Osiris League anymore. I'm done playing in Osiris League, but I really enjoy watching it. And as you can tell, I'm very passionate about it still. You know, but they're absolutely ruining it by not allowing people to spectate. Drago's in 365 and JST was That makes sense. That makes perfect sense. You know, and I get it. Drago Drago was streaming on the official channel the matchup that the community voted on. So it's not like he got to pick it. Right? But let's let's put the shoe on the other foot too. What if those content creators who are streaming on the official channel got to pick the matches that they were casting on that channel? Would they all act with integrity? Would they pick matches that they felt would be close matches? Or would they pick matches so there's tape of potentially their future opponents in the series? I mean, you, you can go any, any one of a hundred ways with this whole scenario. You know, I, I, I'd rather have them cast none at all than be able to pick and choose or even have the community choose. You know, because then, like I said, you're going to have tape on some and not on others. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that OV and HKL match, and if you if you guys if you guys aren't familiar with that match in season three, um, OV versus HKL, literally there were probably a dozen people streaming that match, and when OV won that match at the end, there there I mean things went absolutely crazy. Not only on our Discord. <laughs> But I probably have watched and rewatched that match, DB, at least a dozen times on, on every single streamer's channel. I mean, Gecko is freaking out. Drago is freaking out. Roni, um, you know, everybody was literally freaking out when OV pulled that win out of the out of out of the out, out of that match. You know, and and it was huge in the community as well, right? It was big. It was big time news. It generated posts on Facebook. It generated discussions on on live streams. It it generated a lot of energy that season. 
But yeah, if you can't watch matches, we're never going to see that again. Yep, there, that's a, that's another one when JST lost one of their matches because the gatherer was like three seconds from their city. Right? I mean, this this is all stuff people are not gonna not gonna be able to see if if these matches can't get cast. And in in the same respect, it's gonna make for worse and worse and worse competition. Because how do you improve your matches against other opponents? You watch for mistakes that your team is making. You watch for mistakes that others have made so that you don't repeat making those mistakes. So this is going to water down the competition. It's going to make the competition worse, in my opinion, other than the one or two or three top-tier teams that have the ability to play against other top-tier teams and practice against other top-tier teams week in and week out. You know, like the like the 1960s who can play against 60MX, like the 2049s who have, have four teams in the top 32. You know, it's, it's just a shame. It's a shame. It really is. You know, if they're not going to cast all of them, then... It's better that they cast none of them, but this, this, you know, I thought maybe, maybe, maybe they do it like the NFL. Maybe they do it like uh, uh, MLB, where every single one of them is recorded and put out on a server for people to go back and watch at their leisure. You know, then teams can't complain and say, hey, well, the, you cast this match, you didn't cast that match or, you know, whatever. That was a huge recruiting tool for kingdoms as well. So I don't. I. I mean, I. I don't know what the solution is. I've. But it. Uh, it. It seems like they're going in a direction with this game where they're trying to kill it. But let's be positive. Let's let's switch. Let's put on. Let's put on the positive hat now. We're going to be getting some shit from winning KVK. Can't wait for that. We've got, what, um, 11 days left. we got to grab a sanctuary yet. Got to grab this sanctuary up here. Got to grab this RCF over here. we got to trade RCFs with fire. Um, you know, <laughs> once, once the Diplo with water was done as to who gets what at the end, I said, okay. This, this is done. My part is over. Y'all can plan the rest of this shit. How we get what and where. Because, uh, yeah, I'm done. That, that was like an entire day of work. I will not touch Call of Dragons. Period. You know, everyone says, oh, the graphics are so good. I think the graphics look silly. It looks like a freaking cross between uh, uh, Rise of Kingdoms and uh, Peter Pan. Um, it just it, it does not appeal to me from a visual perspective. It does not appeal to me from a gameplay perspective. It uh, is, is very unappealing. I'll enjoy being a higher power than you for the next 11 days. Yeah, we dropped a lot in this KVK. We dropped a lot. And I was, what, up at, up at 194, 195? Dropped down to 130. Trained back up to 155 for Zenith, and now I'm down to 107. But, I mean, every, everybody in our kingdom dropped a lot. MF had like 17 million deads, which for MF, yeah, that's that's not huge. But, you know, he probably fought half as much as I did. Surge was up in the 170s, the 180s. Um, Stitch, I think, was up in the 160s. Yep, close to 170. Mavic was, was real close to 200. 196. 
Cat's below 100 million power now. She was up around 150, 143. So yeah, I mean, uh, you know, for a leadership team to set the example like these guys do each and every war is absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, that's low for MF. Hey, I got more kill points than MF did in this KVK. I will have you know. By about 5,000. But hey, it counts. Yeah, 17 million deads is, is, is low for MF. Now granted, I think these were... Um, Imperium, uh, Imperium. I think this was the one he was in JST for here. And I think the 40 million one, I think that was the first heroic anthem that uh, 1029 was with 1052. Chilzy, what's going on? Looking for another game to play, but not, not Clash of Clans or not Call of Dragons. I mean, I started playing a game called Viking Rise. It was very similar to this. It just was Viking themed. Played it for a couple of days, just really couldn't get into it. But if you're looking for a game like this, maybe check that out. It's not made by Lilith. What do we have? What do we have to transmutate? Right, I got a couple things that I want to work on. We got this one here. We got to get this archer off of here. We've already tried this twice. Um, we've got this one here on Guan Yu. That has got two really nice inscriptions on it. 10% chance to gain 5% bonus to all damage for 3 seconds. And then a 2.5% skill damage, right? But it's only got one infantry um, attribute on it. So we want to get this one done. Uh, I got about 2.3 billion kill points. Let me, let me try and... Where the hell did I even put the spreadsheets? So here, we'll, we'll, we'll share. We'll share, let's just go full screen, what the hell? So this were, these were kill, kills and deads per camp in the KVK, right? Um, 1029 above and beyond in the wind camp and our allies 2160, phenomenal uh, for the water camp. You know, they had 32 million more kills than we did. They had 43 million more deads than we did. You know, they, they put in a ton of effort, right? But they, they lost their pass. They lost their seven level seven pass multiple times. So that pass went back and forth, which can kind of account for the the higher kills and higher higher deads for sure here. Um, as far as in the KVK itself, uh, I had exactly 2.278 billion kill points and I've had 2.24 billion kill points. Double inscriptions, you gotta get lucky. So yeah, MF 17 million deads, myself 11.1 .1 million. Mavic, like I said, everybody put everybody. Justin coming through. 
Coming through with 10 gifted. Thank you, Justin. We're going to have to go back to the main screen here. Where are we? Rise of Kingdoms right there. Thank you, Justin. Appreciate you. We'll run the Justin soundbite again. So got to catch me. I'm at 13 point. <laughs> Hey, hey, for playing in a D Kingdom, that ain't too bad, my friend. That ain't a C Kingdom, D Kingdom, that ain't too bad. People say you don't get fights in a C key in a low seed kingdom. This is proof that you do. Now, our fights don't last for a week straight, but hey, you know, you got to take it where you can get it. But, uh, thank you once again, Justin. Congratulations on your Osiris League win today. So, I mean, you know, they, they, you know, the, when we discussed final rewards, 2160, guys, if you're looking for a lower sea kingdom to go to, you're looking for something in the European time zone, um, 2160, those guys are fantastic there. I want to want to do a do a live stream with a couple of them eventually get them on here so that they can plug their kingdom because uh, yeah like I said we've allied with them three KVKs all three KVKs have been victories Sargon Skippy or Skippy Sargon I think most people I I see run Sargon Scipio. now me I still run Guan. Uh, Guan Scipio and Sargon CJ. But most people I'm seeing in a lot of these KBKs are running with uh, Sargon primary, Scipio behind them. 1052 is a C or a D now? Are they really? We might see them in a KBK. That would be fun. MF versus Slouty. That, uh, did that race against time deal or whatever it's called not race against time protect the supplies deal man that thing screws me every single time every single time what place am I wouldn't be surprised if I dropped down to fifth fourth place every time the boss and the final you know I'll be at a hundred percent until the final final group drops and it'll it'll just drop seven or eight of them right on top of that caravan you know whereas i i've watched you know because these other guys they'll ask for justice so they can do it i'll watch them and you know it'll it'll drop it'll drop their their uh barbarians or whatever they're called you know miles away from the caravan they got time to slowly go through pick them off one by one you know whereas me it just it just drops them all right on the freaking caravan piss me the hell off But hey, fourth place, eight gold heads, we'll take it, we'll take it, we'll take it. Got to upgrade a skill, getting my eighth place, got to upgrade a skill on Bertrand, oh boy. Got my eighth place in Mightiest Governor. I don't know how much he'll be used. Maybe he could pair with uh, Justin. Oh, Justin, if you're still here, we were, um, we were, uh, we, we were laughing the other day because, uh, you've got your own commander, but Baba still doesn't have one yet, so. Get off my lawn. Find your lawn. Maybe 
have any gathering bastions that I can just get somebody going for? I do not have fun in this event. This event here, somebody's getting zeroed. Somebody's getting zeroed. I'm waiting for somebody else to go and zero them though, because it will uh... <laughs> go on 15 million. I hope he's a decent commander. Well, with the name like Justin, he's got to be decent, right? Hey, Bert, uh, Bert Nevsky actually beats Dito Hera, so Bert's not completely bad. And if you ask a lot of cavalry players who are strictly cavalry, they're using Bert in the open field. I don't freaking understand it myself, but... Yeah, I just want to let one of the other guys zero uh, zero that guy because it's a fairly easy zero. And... So with fighting being over, I didn't necessarily redo my canyon lineup, but I went through and I put uh, put better equipment on my canyon commanders. Right. We, Upgraded Richard. Um, we upgraded Trajan. And then we took uh, Henry's stuff off and put it on Ludica. Oh, what the hell? Help you have something on Guam, right? Make sure Nevsky's set too. What the? What up, Swizz? Here you go, Swizz. I got a job for you. You can zero this guy. <coughs> no, I didn't do anything bad. That the uh. Yesterday, I couldn't do anything yesterday. Not a damn thing at all. Right? Because... I mean, these points are so tight right here, and I did not want to get above Shadow and above BT to, to, you know, skip my spot. I was 8th spot. But I logged in yesterday. I was playing other games yesterday. Playing Uncharted and um, a little bit of Dying Light and, you know, this, that, and the other thing. I logged in yesterday and I collected my collected my troops, you know, that were training. And I, these these points were so close that it jumped me ahead of Shadow and uh, ahead of BT. So I immediately let them know in our Discord said, "Hey, you guys are going to need to pass me." But I mean, I literally I did all I did yesterday was run some barb forts here and there. I can't farm. I didn't want to pass them. You know, couldn't do any barbarians. Didn't want to pass them. But the one time I wake up from a nap, I log in, I collect my uh, collect my training, uh, my guys who are training, and I pass them. And it's like fuck. So that's why they were joking about zero and me. Okay, gonna zero me, bring it on. 
I'm okay. Do it now. Do it now while I get half my dents back. Do it now. <laughs> Uh, go for it, go for it. All right, it is reset, so let's get our shit done. And up come the renewing members. So for all you renewing, thank you, thank you. Only 20 likes on the stream. What the hell? Come on, guys. You can do it. Swarm that like button. Get our free stuff first. Okay. Materials next. get our speed ups and we need our engineering blueprints or leadership sorry leadership not engineering leadership we want our goldies I know painful to watch isn't it Stones. I don't buy these anymore. They're not worth it. <clears throat> yeah, we still got we still got stuff we can get if more than gems does pop. Close we are to making a corn. Yeah, maybe a, a week, maybe next week. all this shit scrolling across the top here. What's up, Pete? Yeah, DB, the double inscriptions, it's completely random. And here's the stupid thing about armaments, right? You cannot... So the legendary armaments have a space for two inscriptions. The only way to get two inscriptions is to open a chest, get them completely random from dispatching, from traveling. You cannot take an armament that has one inscription on it and add a second inscription to it. Just stupid, absolutely stupid. We will go and transmutate that uh, one armament here very shortly. Mm, how 
how do I beat you? Try to remember. I think it's this way. No, it's not. Did I get it right? No, oh, no. Oh. Virgin Lasky. One. There we go. Really, I still do the traveling. You know, I mean, if the only way you can get a double inscription is by random, you know, you kind of kind of got to. All right, is it this one we wanna? Yes, it is this one. We wanna lock down health. Free attack, okay, we'll replace that. Let's save the attack for now. The attack could always be better. We can do this one time. Or maybe though. No. It, it doesn't tell me how many stones I have here, does it? There we go. So, I mean, right, not fantastic, 1.9 and 1.8, but we took this double inscription from a single infantry stat to triple stack. So, I'll take it, right? We'll take it. I got four stones left, so I can't do the other one that I wanted to do. Which I think is this one. No, don't have enough. So not bad, not a bad day's work, right? So they got uh, they got the new Greek commanders in the gold and the silver keys, but not yet in the shop here. Kind of disappointed about that, but ooh. That's what all that stuff popping up on the screen was about, huh? Oh, we just got three more. Nice. Nice. Okay. Okay, we can do the Nevsky one, too. I hope it tells me when that comes up. What did I get? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I don't remember. I came out ahead. I came out ahead happy. Holy crap. You're done. Only one more attempt. Let's see. That's, that's the one thing I don't like about this is that, uh, um, damn it. Once you, once you do it 10 times, it should let you pick the attribute you want to replace. You know, sure, make it a random percentage, but let you pick. You know, like in the case of that one, uh, I, you know, pick something related to, um, obviously cavalry. Come on, dude, ready up. Uh, 
and I didn't even pick my skills. Like it matters, really assault is so damn easy. No strategy to this whatsoever. Nice, Ghost. Nice, DB. I win. It's a race. I win. Those are some nice stats too. Are you still primarily infantry player? Esmeralda, I, I'm so tempted because I need the materials, but she fucking robs me blind every time. How much is this rolling today? What do you mean rolling? I don't know if I'm doing Esmeralda. I honestly don't. That makes too much sense, Crow Gaming. That makes way too much logical sense. Since when has uh, anything in this game ever been logic logical, right? I mean, archers are supposed to beat infantry and cavalry is supposed to beat archers, but um, that's not always the case either. <laughs> you know? You're trying to apply logic to Lilith thinking. It's not possible. How are things going today? Good. Good. We got uh, we got one uh, one legendary armament triple stacked for Guan Yu. So uh, hey, it's a win. It's a win. Why, why do these people click the button if they're not ready to start the match? I mean, seriously. 
Why do you do a, do a quick join if you're not ready to start the match? Come on, guys. Why are you bringing a healer? We don't need a freaking healer. Just bring high damage DPS. Come on. Are we noobs here? Boudicca ZL doing some damage for that guy. That was quick. Nice. I'll take it. I'll take it. What do you guys think? Do we do Esmeralda? Of course, it's not, it's not your gems that are being spent here, right? <laughs> we need to hit at least 30 likes and then, then okay, let's get at least 30 likes and then, uh, then maybe we do that Esmeralda, right? A couple more likes, come on, y'all can do it, y'all can do it. Refresh my, my the stream just to see where we're at. Still says, still says 27. Still says 27. What's in there? Or you can just, no, I don't jump troops. Really, only five votes. One more. One more like. One more like. One more like. All right. All right. For the content, right? For the content. <laughs> <laughs> okay there's a few i really could care less about the building speed ups though i told you she robs me blind every time Oh, there we go. I'll take that. Very nice. Need a couple more like that. Oh, there's a good one. There is isn't a okay, okay. You ain't so bad today, are you, Esmeralda? Okay. So not, I mean, definitely one of my better Esmeralda trips. 
and we'll take that to just 100 tomorrow. There's no sense in going past 100. Oh, did that get us any closer? Eight away. Eight away. So that, that got us quite a few, right? I think this was at, what, 22 earlier? Not bad. Not bad. Full production. Did I pop my buffs? I always have 40 minutes left. I'll just do it before I forget. So between Cerulean Assault, Esmeralda, and Esmeralda, not bad. Not bad. I'll take it. We will take it. Rip gems, though, right? Rip my gems. We only had a hundred and some odd keys. I did open those earlier. Only got uh, two of the new guy, two of the Greek legendary guy. Oh boy, El Cid, oh boy. We'll get some value here, right? Grant me the strength to protect my tribe. I am a little bit of everything. Um, I have every single archer commander expertise. Cavalry, the only cavalry I don't have expertise is Bertrand. Um, the only infantry I don't have expertise is Tariq. So, and there's Happy stopping by to say hello. Hello, Happy. Um, I'm a little bit of everything. I have. The skins that I have are archer skins. So we've got the 10% defense. We've got the 15% uh, attack. Um, I have more gear for archers than I do for infantry and cavalry. I, kind of, I guess I kind of fancy myself as an archer player, but... You just want, you just want all of my equipment, don't you? How many of these damn bastions do I even need to do yet? In case almost over.
51. So 51 and there's how many days left? 10 days. So that's what, five a day? Plus one. One thousand seven hundred new cavalry. Are the new cavalry listed? They are. Who do you think this so Electro King and I were going back and forth. Electro King's like, yeah, this new guy looks like XY. I said, I think he looks more like Lubu. What do you guys think? Does he look more like XY? Or does he look more like Lubu? The feathers on XY? Okay, I understand. I just think the overall build, I mean, XY is kind of chunky. He's a bigger boy. Lubu's got the more slender build. And XY's got, uh, you know, he's got kind of a toga thing going here, right? Who's got the armor? HQ's got the more armor. A little fancier armor, but I don't know. What do you guys think? It looks like neither. <laughs> You're no help, only farmer. You're no help. looks French. I can kind of see that with the kind of the, the frilly Victorian type uh, collar and big poofy arms, right? First pop, you're in KVK already? Oh, Pioneer event. Okay, I'm trying to suck you in with the Pioneer event. Okay, I understand now. I get it. It took me a minute. It's past my bedtime.
level 15. Is that close to me? What do they got here? A minute 24. It'll be close. It'll be close. Well, the new, the new HQ, I think he'll replace XY, both in squishiness and in uh, open field. I mean, I'm not going to rush either of them. I'm going to slow play both of them, spin the wheel as many times as I can, and uh, get as many placements in MGE as I can before before we extra TC either of them. Figure we're just coming out of a KVK. We're going to skip a minimum of one. So I've got a few MGEs before I really need to make any decisions there. still three minutes away. Go faster, CC. Go faster. Waiting. How close is your city to that one? Looks like Disney's Mulan. That's perfect, Pete. That is perfect. <laughs> it does. It does. The animated, animated Mulan, right? See, here's another chain that I did today. Proof, proof Lambo can chain. <laughs> I really hope I'm headed to the correct... Uh, 15, they're 59 seconds away. I am a minute 15 away. Good, I'll get there in plenty of time. I'll get there faster. Hope that uh, I can get in the rally now. That's why I brought minimal troops. What the hell? Did it not let me join a rally? I should be able to reinforce it, right? Or do I got to do it from this screen? Why? Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Go, 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 get in there. 
Hello. I should tell you you're out of AP instead of just not working. We need archers big time. I gotta watch that gold head event though too. I can't can't go over that dude. Yami, I think he's got first place in that. Oh, plenty of room. Plenty of space. Oops. Sorry, XY, you're by yourself today. suck. Uh, give me a new Greek guy. Give me some more of him. Sheeta. Oh boy, Gaius.
After the students, what building do they return to? The academy, maybe? I don't know. Luger pistols, 9mm. How many passes do you need to clear to get a go? That's every three, right? Oh, yep. Colonel Sanders. Nika. Back. Oh my goodness. Hey, last one was a lucky guess. Four more, four more. God, I hate burning through these, but hey, I want to get these bastions done and not have to worry about it tomorrow. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're absolutely correct. He was a bad dude in Gladiator. Commodus, mm, I don't remember the dude's full name. They each had like 10 names there. Oh shit. Damn it. My mouse fingers were not quick enough. Not that I ever do that uh, final exam anyway, but I always seem to miss it. It's always on Saturdays and I'm doing something else. Or... There we go. I gotta look and see when the NFL season starts, when preseason starts. I <laughs> get kicked out first question. Yeah, those final exam questions are uh, a hell of a lot different than these questions. Well, yeah, I know where I like with them. <clears throat> All right, let's see, what do we got? We gotta get some food. Rambo needs wood. August 10th.
Yes, in Lambo, can I get a pit and LPK, please? Uh, which of these instances I have LPK on, but yeah, we'll get there. We'll get there. Now I need to find some gold. Oh, I guess I'm already getting gold here, so okay. done, my bashing quests are done, it's going to be a nice easy day on rock tomorrow. Let's see, what did we build last in LPK? That was, oh, okay, we did stone and gold and gold and Registered for the new KVK. You, which which kingdom? Again, only farmer. Is that? I know you're in one of the big kingdoms. I don't know if all your accounts are there, or just the one. Stacks building a pit here. Let's just uh, get all our farmers out here. Yes, El Cid and Lancelot. Alright, I think uh, I think that's that's it for today. Not a long stream, I know, but um, got some shit done. Got a lot of shit done that I needed to get done at reset there. Let's see what do we got going on? Customization, redirect. Who is still streaming out there? Black Panther is live, so we'll get you over to Black Panther. Uh, when you get to Panther stream, tell them hey from Lambo, Lambo Raid. Do it up when you get there. You guys know what to do. Appreciate you all for joining me tonight. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow, do some other stuff tomorrow. We'll see what's going on. Maybe look for a kingdom to migrate one of my second accounts to. To cure the boredom. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. We'll see. In any case, I appreciate each and every one of you. Justin, thanks again for the 10 gifted. And uh, we'll catch you next time.